A female darts player who breaks all the records of the best male darts players? Today, we take you inside this legendary female darts player who has surprised darts fans around the whole world. Dobro Maslova's journey into the world of darts is like a captivating novel, where talent meets opportunity in a landscape largely untouched by the sport. She started playing at 12 in Russia, quickly dominating and winning the national championship 10 times. Her victories reflected the early stage of darts in Russia. In 2004, at the Bavaria World Darts Trophy, Dobra Maslova entered the professional stage with flair, facing Trina Gulliver and showcasing her prodigious talent. Though she narrowly lost to Francis Hunsalar in the final, it was clear a new force had emerged. By 2007, she stepped onto the iconic lakeside stage in the BDO World Championship, reaching the semi-finals and facing Trina Gulliver again. Despite falling short, Dobra Mislova's prowess was affirmed, leading to triumphs at the England Open, the British Open, and more singles titles across Europe. She also clinched the ladies' pairs title at the 2007 WDF World Cup in the Netherlands. The zenith of her career was in 2008, when she returned to Lakeside as the number four seed. Triumphing over Dee Bateman and Stephanie Smee, she set the stage for a historic showdown with Trina Gulliver in the final ending Gulliver's seven-year reign as the world champion. The narrative took an unexpected turn when Dobra Mislova, breaking barriers, qualified for the 2008 PDC Major Tournament, the UK Open. Winning through the pub qualifiers, she faced Robert Thornton in the first round, a clash of BDO titans. Thornton narrowly secured a 6-5 victory, leaving fans on the edge of their seats. However, the climax of this saga wasn't solely on the dartboard. The 2008 Zududuin Masters, where Dobra Maslova was named the top seed, saw a twist of fate. Dutch authorities, citing visa issues, excluded her from the competition, forcing an abrupt withdrawal. Lisa Ashton stepped into her shoes, marking a curious chapter in Dobra Maslova's extraordinary career. Dobra Maslova, the BDO Ladies World Champion, received an unexpected invitation from the PDC to play in the 2008 Grand Slam of Darts, making a historic moment as the first ever female player invited to this prestigious event. In her group, she found herself pitted against giants of the game, reigning PDC world champion John Part, the formidable Ken McDyne, and the charismatic Wayne Mardle. The challenge was immense, and while her opening match against Part ended in a 5-1 loss, Dobra Mislova made a statement in her match against Mardle. Trailing 4-0, she roared back, winning four consecutive legs, including a dazzling Shanghai 120 checkout and a 116, before Mardle narrowly secured the deciding leg. A third defeat followed, a 5-2 loss to McDyne. As December unfolded, she entered the 2008 World Masters as the number one ranked ladies darts player, reaching the final only to face another setback against Hunsalar. Yet, the darting world was in for a seismic shift. In a surprise move, Dobra Mislova announced her departure from the WDF slash BDO circuit. This announcement coincided with her being granted a wildcard entry into the 2009 PDC World Darts Championship due to the withdrawal of an unnamed Indian qualifier. The decision stirred controversy, drawing public criticism from the legendary five-time world champion Eric Bristow. Nevertheless, Dobra Mislova became the second female player to enter a men's world darts championship a feat previously achieved by Canadian Gail King in 2001. Her preliminary round drew her against Remco Van Aden, where she fought valiantly but lost five legs to three. In 2009, she secured her place in the UK Open once again, this time through her UK Open Order of Merit ranking, having accumulated £500 in seven qualifying events. Her opponent in the first round was amateur qualifier Andy Roberts, and despite a spirited effort, she faced a 6-2 defeat. As the PDC sought to redefine women's presence in darts, Dobra Mislova found herself at the forefront. With their introduction of the Women's World Championship, she automatically qualified as the sole female member of the PDPA. In the semi-finals, however, she encountered a formidable foe in Stacey Bromberg, who ultimately triumphed and went on to beat Trisha Wright in the final. Embarking on the 2009 Grand Slam of Darts, Anastasia Dobromyslova faced darting titans like Phil Taylor and Mark Webster. It was a formidable challenge, and her first clash was against none other than the legendary Phil Taylor. The match turned into a tough encounter, with Dobra Mislova experiencing a 5-0 defeat. Yet, in this sea of giants, she found a glimmer of triumph. Vincent van der Voort, another formidable opponent, became the canvas for her historic moment, 
she secured a five-fall victory, etching her name in the record books as the second woman ever to conquer a male player in a major televised darting showdown. This was a monumental achievement, following in the footsteps of Dieter Hedman's feats in the 2005 UK Open. However, the joy of this victory was somewhat tempered. The group stage ended with a defeat against Mark Webster, resulting in Dobromislova's finishing at the bottom. A twist of fate occurred as Van der Voort surprisingly defeated Taylor 5-1 in the subsequent days, reshaping the group dynamics. As the years rolled on, Dobromislova faced hurdles on her journey. Attempts to qualify for the PDC World Championship in 2010 and 2011 proved elusive, despite entering the Russian PDC qualifying events. In 2010, the final was within reach, but Roman Konchikov claimed victory. The disappointment echoed in 2011, as Andrei Ratkinov triumphed in the final. However, fate played a curious card when Ratnikinov withdrew from the competition due to family reasons. The PDC, in an unexpected move, granted the preliminary round spot to the runner-up Matt Padgett instead of Dobra Maslova. Amidst these challenges, the inaugural PDC World Cup of Darts in 2010 saw Dobra Maslova representing Russia alongside Konchikov. They made a promising start by defeating Gibraltar, but their journey was halted by the Scottish duo of Gary Anderson and Robert Thornton. The darting world was taken aback when on December 24th, 2010, rumours circulated about Dobra Maslova's departure from the PDC. The speculations found confirmation on January 1st, 2011, during the BBC's broadcast of the 2011 BDO World Darts Championship. David Croft, the commentator, announced her return to the BDO circuit. Subsequently, via her Twitter page, Dobra Maslova confirmed the move, citing financial considerations as the driving force behind her decision. Returning to the BDO proved to be a fruitful decision for Dobra Maslova. In 2012, she not only participated, but excelled in the BDO World Darts Championship. The quarterfinal witnessed her triumph over Julie Gore, and in the semi-final, she faced the reigning champion Trina Gulliver. Dobra Maslova's skill and determination led to a two-set victory, setting the stage for a compelling final against Dieter Heidmann. The match saw a rocky start with Dobra Maslova losing the first set, but a spirited comeback, breaking Hedman's throw, resulted in her second world championship win. The narrative continued in 2013, as Dobra Maslova secured her third world title. In a riveting match against Lisa Ashton, the set score unfolded with a 2-1 victory, adding another glorious chapter to Dobra Maslova's remarkable journey through the world of darts. The triumph of 2013 marked a high point, but the journey of Anastasia Dobra Maslova took unexpected turns. Another world final beckoned in 2018, where she faced off against Lisa Ashton. Despite a valiant effort, she succumbed to a 3-1 defeat. Nevertheless, she clinched a coveted spot in the 2019 PDC World Championship after winning the rest of the World Women's Qualifier. The anticipation was high, yet the reality was a 3-0 loss to Ryan Joyce in the first round, with Dobra Maslova averaging just 77 during the match. Over the years, her career faced challenges, notably as her Russian nationality became a complicating factor. Banned from WDF events, including the 2022 World Championships, for which she had qualified, she found herself sidelined from major competitions. Undeterred, she participated in 20 of the 24 PDC Women's Series events in 2023 under a neutral flag. Despite the hurdles, she showcased resilience, finishing 10th on the order of merit. Her performance in September stood out, reaching back-to-back -back finals, a testament to her unwavering commitment. However, the statistics tell a story of struggle. Her average for the year hovered at just 70.8, ranking 17th on the tour. Yet, in each dart throne, there lies a story of determination, navigating challenges and competing at the highest level under unique circumstances. Anastasia Dobromislova's journey is a testament to the indomitable spirit of a player whose love for the game transcends border and adversity. Don't forget to hit the bullseye so you never miss out on any of our amazing darts videos. See you next time.